Welcome to another one of our Bluebeam Me Up How To tutorials, brought to you by Brighter Graphics Limited, where we show you how to maximize the potential of your investment in Bluebeam Review. Brighter Graphics are the oldest established Bluebeam partner and your premium Bluebeam solutions provider. Let's get started. In this video, we are going to show you how to create a session and upload documents in Bluebeam Review. Studio sessions allow you to collaborate in real-time markup sessions in the cloud. It doesn't matter if you're in the field. Using review on your iPad or in the office using review on your desktop. Project team members get all the markups on the same document at the same time anywhere in the world. All that data and activity can then be tracked in studio sessions. You don't even need an internet connection. If you are working in a session and lose connectivity. Your markups will be saved automatically and are added onto session documents when you reconnect. Once you're signed in click on the sessions tab and any sessions you are part of will be listed. When a user initiates a studio session, they are responsible for inviting others, uploading documents and setting permissions. To start a session, click add, which looks like a plus sign. Then click on new session. Enter in the name of the session then add the files you want to mark up. You can add up to 5,000 files per session. If you need a predefined order of the files, click the double arrows, and choose a sorting order of your choice. For a custom order select the file and use the up and down arrows to place it accordingly. If you need to remove a file, select the file, and click remove which is marked by a red X. When starting a session, you can also choose basic permissions for all your attendees. Check the boxes for the actions you want users to be able to take in the sessions. If you just want users to mark up select that option and deselect any others. This will only allow them to mark up, and they won't be able to save a copy of the file or any of the other options. There is also the option to restrict attendees by email address which only allows those people with the added email address to join the session. Leaving it unchecked allows anyone to join the session if they have the session ID. You can also set when the session expires by checking the setting expires box and setting the date and time you would like it to expire. These can be edited later. When you click OK review will upload the files to the session and add you to invite users to the session. Thank you for watching. We hope you found the video useful. You can visit our website, www.brightergraphics.com, for more videos in the How To series and all things Bluebeam Review. We at Brighter Graphics welcome your feedback to help us to improve.